A scary movie is only as good as the house it's filmed in. Think about it. Someone all by themselves in a gorgeous, spacious home? Of course something bad's about to happen. These are the top 10 coolest, most horrifying movie houses that you'd want to live in. You know, minus all the scary stuff that happens. Number 10, Intruders. The exterior of this house is gorgeous, from the front porch to the balcony and those massive white columns. But the interior could definitely use an update. Thanks to its good bones, this house lands at number 10. Number 9, The Hand That Rocks the Cradle. This traditional house has it all. The dreamy front porch, the cute nursery, and a spacious kitchen. After 26 years, it needs some upgrades. So it's coming in at number 9 on our list. Number 8, House on Elm Lake. This lakefront property might have a modern kitchen and a front porch, but it's sort of the creepiest looking home ever. No waterfront view can make up for that, or the fact that it's possessed by demons. It takes the number eight spot on our list. Number seven, Beetlejuice. Okay, okay, so Beetlejuice may not be a scary movie, but it is creepy, and this country home is too awesome to ignore. The house looks good before and after a posh modern makeover, and who could forget that amazing attic? We're putting this one at number seven. Number six, Disturbia. If you can forget about the basement full of dead bodies, this house is actually a suburban dream home. The blue and white color combo is classic, and there's even a two-car garage. Then again, there's no pool, so we'll have to give this house the number six spot. No, come on, man. Okay, so the takeaway from all of this might be to never buy a lakefront home. This movie, about a woman who's either being haunted by a ghost or is losing her mind, has killer waterfront views, and a terrifying secret. But let's overlook that and focus on this gorgeous pergola. That traditional style is enough to put this house at number five. Number four, The Haunting. This spooky mansion looks like it's something straight out of Harry Potter. Those long hallways, intricate woodwork, and huge stairwells all play into the creepy castle vibe. But it might be a little too much, so it's coming in at number four. Number three, The Glass House. This early 2000s film would be largely forgettable if it weren't for the house at the center of it all. It's so modern, it may make you overlook the weak plotline. This place has everything. The pool, the sleek staircases, the funky art. It's a solid three on this list. Number two, The Others. Did you know this house is actually a castle in Spain? I guess that explains all the rich architecture, incredible woodwork, and those massive, creepy windows. Oh, and who could forget that incredible yard? That's all enough to land this house our number two slot. So which house earned the number one spot? When a stranger calls. This lakefront property has killer views. Poor choice of words, I can't help it. From the floor to ceiling windows to the open staircase where the babysitter fights off her attacker, this modern mansion deserves all the praise. Plus, with an indoor koi pond and a chic guest house, it's no wonder this place is at the top of our list.